Well, all right, we're heading out of here today. We've uh, got uh, 6980 Bravo fixed and repaired. We're going to go and uh, at home. I had to leave it here in Hot Springs, Arkansas for a week. Four hour drive for me, so not that much fun, I can assure you. Hot Springs area traffic, but that's 690 Bravo. Taxiing back on Echo to 31 Hot Springs. Oh, I'll go over some of this stuff in the air with what happened, but basically we had a uh, wire, wiring harness issue and uh, it shut off two of our, one of our spark plugs completely and the other partially shut down. And so we needed a new wiring harness to repair all that. We thought it was a mag issue at first. We rebuilt the mag and it didn't help. Hot Springs area traffic, Nanza 6980 Bravo, crossing 23 at Echo Hot Springs. Level 1-1, no Oh, welcome back, everybody. We are uh, finishing up our IFR flight from Hot Springs. Texas Flying 1, Resnick, Brooks, copy. 
Feedback good. Got this one traffic swing near 11 and 12 o'clock, 10 miles north eastbound of the air and level 111,000. Searching Cactus 1. November 0 Kilo Golf, the uh, airport says you're 12 o'clock, 10 miles. And we're looking, 0 Kilo Golf. Flying an RNAV 02 into Rogers. Uh, normally we would intercept this inter uh, initial approach fix at 3,100 feet, but he only intercepted 4,000. So once we intercept it and we're established, we'll let him know. He'll switch us to tower. We'll drop down to 3,000 for our final approach fix. We should intercept the glide slope there. You will know, be able to look on the uh, iPad here. I can show you kind of the path we're taking. There'll be a little bit of a right turn. So, hey, shout out to the guys at Memphis Center. Uh, uh, the radio wasn't on at the time. The cameras weren't on at the time, but uh, uh, got a call out from those guys. So I want to say hey. At uh, Memphis Center, uh, 6980 Bravo, thanks for all your help. Hi, Papa Golf, at your 1 o'clock now, 4 miles. Hi, Papa Golf, look at X1 traffic, now it's 12 o'clock, 4 miles. Search and X1. All right. As Mr. McConaughey says, all right, all right, all right. Traffic inside, X1. Uh, Papa Golf, that truck's at 1 o'clock, as you know. We'll be turning in about 45 seconds. Uh, we're turning in 3, 2, 1, and. Intercepting. Texas one contact approach one two zero point nine. Good day. Twenty point nine. Texas one two. Hey, Joe Bravo. We're uh, intercepting Honan four thousand. Uh, established RNAV zero two into Rogers. Hey, Joe Bravo. Hey, Joe Bravo. Roger cleared RNAV two. Contact Roger Tower one nine point three seven. Good day. Nineteen thirty seven. Hey, Joe Bravo. Good day. Afternoon, Rogers Tower, Manhattan 6980 Bravo on the RNAV 02, just inside Honan. So, 6980 Bravo, Rogers Tower, report a final approach fix. Report Wetco, 80 Bravo. All right, I got Rogers in sight. We're crabbing pretty, pretty darn good here. A 27 knot crosswind right here coming in. But uh, thankfully, it's only eight knots on the ground, so. Told me to intercept what go, let him know when we're there. And uh, he should clear us at that point to land. So we're descending now down to 500 feet a minute. 3,600 feet right now going to 3,000. Intercepting wet go. That's where we should intercept our slide path. So fuel selectors are good. I'll go ahead and kick the lights on. Mixture will do last. Fuel pump is off. Port emergency preach are good. For prop and gear will do. And landing clearance we don't have yet. So we got one, two, three, four switches left to go record these for you, show you what I'm talking about. These are Missionary Bush Pilots uh, switches for clearance checklists, and they are very, very handy, so shout out to Missionary Bush Pilot. Eight miles until wet go. Uh, happy sight to see Rogers today. I wasn't sure I was going to make it home. I thought I was going to have to stay the night in Hot Springs again. It worked out really good. All right, five, four, three, two, one. We'll intercept our glide path. Let's go ahead and drop our gear. Hey, zero Bravo, intercept the wet go. 
Clear Bar, runway two, clear to land, winds three three zero one zero. Clear to land, eight zero bar, thanks. So, we did our landing checklist. We got our gear down. We'll go ahead and go approach flaps. They are transitioning, and I can transition. That's good. Top and mixture, we still got those to go. And we, we do have landing clearance. So the last two switches we got are prop and mixture uh, to complete our pre-landing checklist. And I texted my wife, so hopefully she'll be there when I land, and we won't have to wait too long to get a ride back home. I am starving. I want some. I want to get some homemade brisket tonight at home. Make a brisket sandwich. We're on a perfect glide path here. We have mixture prop and full flaps to go. Go ahead and shut down the iPad since you know what we're doing at this point. Nineteen knots coming from the northwest. It was twenty seven knots just a moment ago, so it's slowly getting better. Looks like we're on a perfect glide path. to hear the 500 foot call out. Go full mixture, full prop. 500 feet will engage full flaps. Here we go, full flaps. 500. They are engaged. Still crabbing pretty good. Got a little bit of crosswind here. 16 knots still. That's kicking us around just a little bit here. All right, I got red, blue, green, three green, clear to end. All our toggles are switched. We're good to go. Minimums, minimums. Minimums. Our speed looks really good. Still crabbing quite a bit, down to a 13 knot cross. That looks like I'm gonna have a pretty good cross today. That's all right. All right. We'll ride that wheelie as long as we can. Yeehaw! Six by Azure Bar, right turn at Delta Tax Park. Right on Delta Tax Park, Azure Bar, thanks, so. And we're down, we'll go ahead and pull our mixture back and lean it a bit. Until we get off the runway here to clean up the rest of it. I can say, uh, Randy from Alpha 10 Aviation, she ran like a kitten. Thank you, sir. All right, if you like these videos, the uh, biggest thank you can give us is a thumbs up, a like, and subscribe. And please share these videos with your friends. We want to share our love for aviation with as many people, uh, as, many people as we can. Like and subscribe, and if you would, if you have questions of any kind, uh, put them down in the comments below. We'll answer you. We'd love to engage with our our uh, watchers, and viewers, and talk shop, talk talk planes. So, thanks for watching. Hope y'all have a blessed weekend and go Hogs tomorrow. Let's beat Auburn. Six nine eight zero Bravo out.